Hey what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel today. Today guys we have episode number one of the second season of the Cardiff Career Mode on FIFA 19. Now thank you guys so much for the support on the first season. It was really really good. Um, I did not expect to get that much support and likes and views on that series in general. Uh, so I want to say thank you for that. For starting off this series, uh, season sorry. Um, we didn't actually get Europa League. Now, I know I finished 7th and I was supposed to get a um, qualifying round position. But if we go here, and I'll show you guys why we didn't. Because um, if we go, if we keep going over to Europa League. <clears throat> really annoying because I thought we actually got a Europa League spot. Which was um, really annoying. As you'll see, look, qualifying round. Watford are in there. It's because Watford won the... I think it must have been the FA Cup or the Euro uh, Carabao Cup. So because Watford finished outside the position and they won the cup, then they because normally what would happen, you'd expect like the top four to win the cup, and then the position for the Europa League would get dropped down to seventh, uh, which we missed out on because Watford finished below us and then they won the thing. So we've missed out on that, which is annoying. Here's the squad as you can see here. Um, you might notice a little bit something different. Obviously, Bamba's gone now. He he left on a free. Uh, Aaron Ramsey's joined on a pre-contract, which we did do um, quite early on in the season. I'm pretty sure we did it in January uh, of last season. So he's in here now. I'm going to bring back Camarasa right now for Rouse. Rouse is going to drop down to the bench, but Camarasa was very very good for me last season, and um, I think it would be very stupid for me not to bring him back. As you can see here. Harry Arto as well, but he's 29, and I don't really want to be spending like six plus million on him. And we've got quite a few because of the introduction of Ramsey. I don't need Harry Arto anymore, even though he was superb for us. Um, I'm not going to go for him again. Uh, as you can also notice, all these suggestions were left on the video, um, the season finale video. So I'm going to give you another chance to comment your players you want me to sign down below i'll give it a good f like f maybe three or four days until i upload the next video so i can collect all those um transfer suggestions and then i'll pick from maybe the best probably the best rated or the youngest or the most cheapest uh, in terms of our money because we've only got like 40 million i think um well not only but like we haven't got much compared to what i was expecting like at the end of the last season it, get, it said like 150 million and we didn't even get that we got like a little look we're on 38 million so Camarasa I need Camarasa in the squad so I'm gonna offer 12 and a half million for him hopefully his price hasn't gone up because of how well he played for us 14 million I'll drop it down to 13 see if they will take that because 13 is reasonable it's in between okay they're not gonna drop down I'll accept that because I need him in the squad I want him so going for his um Going for his a uh, wages now. Hopefully he doesn't want too much because I don't want to sign at, at least three players. Um, even though we did get Ramsey in, uh, crucial first team player. Him and Ramsey will be playing in the middle of the park together. Um, also, like I said, uh, I want at least two more signings. Preferably maybe a new centre back. Uh, maybe a left back as well. I'm not too sure. Maybe a new winger because Hoylet's getting old, but we do have Murphy on the bench. I might just offload some players, you know. Um, let me just counter this and remove bonus and then do that. There we go. That's perfect. 24 million left over. It's not that bad. We could easily sign a couple of youngsters or like Tovan, unfortunately. I'm not going to be able to sign him. Uh, thank you for su suggesting him in the comments, but he's not, I haven't got enough money even though I thought I was going to. Someone like Dante could be good for a season, um, just to have that experience there. Um, but I will leave that for now. Um, that will be done. Uh, I will not be uh, touching transfers for uh, and just until uh, this video goes live and then you guys get to leave your suggestions. Now, obviously, I'm going to put Camarasa back in the side. He was very, very good for me. Uh, Rouse will come onto the bench for Cooper. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do for now. So, the team... Morrison and Nampatu at the moment, uh, you quite easily could put someone else, but you know, Morrison did well for us, he's only 28, he's not that old, um, Camaras and Ramsey, very good, Loftus-Cheek was probably our best player last season, N Nier was Hoylet as well, Narsing was alright, but you know, I could probably improve on the left wing or right wing, Origi was alright, I might sell Origi, I'm not too sure um, what I want to do with him, 
Uh, Cunningham was good as well. He's getting old a little bit. Patterson was brilliant at right back. And he's only 24, so um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do. So leave your suggestions. Preferably a centre-back, right-back, left-back, left or right wing, or maybe even a striker. I might sell Origi. I'm not sure. Let me know um, your thoughts on those comments down below in terms of players I should sell. Move on, you know, loan them out, sell them, replace, like, re replace Origi with another striker, or replace Narsing with a new right wing, or, but Patterson's going to stay in the squad, Cunningham will probably stay in the squad, I'm not too sure yet, so, for the rest of the episode, I'm just going to go walk through the pre-season tournament, um, I'm going to do it all live now, uh, simming it, of course, because I don't, unless we get to the final, I'll play it, but if not, um, I just want to get this episode out to show you guys, uh, what the plan is for this um, season ahead. Now we go one them up straight away with Ari there, eight minutes in against Parma. I don't know if they've. Oh, Ramsey missed a penalty on his debut for Cardiff, not great. And Origi doubles it there with two, two for himself to make it 2 0. Morrison getting a yellow card there. Uh, Origi getting a hat trick. Wow, he's making a statement for me not to sell him. And Camaras has just got injured on his first game back. That's not good. Please say it's not out. He's not out for long. Because that is very worrying already. We've already got a player injured. And I don't want that. If it would hurry up and update the facts and fix figures. Thank you. So how long is this injury? Please don't be long. Seven weeks. Oh my god. And obviously I forgot to show you that before. Seven weeks. Oh my god. That is frustrating. Camera has come straight out. I'm going to have to put Rouse in there. And I'll, I mean... It, it lets Cooper come onto the bench, but still, that's very frustrating. I did not want that to happen. Oh, wow. That is very, very annoying. Anyway, we move on. Wow, I can't believe that. I mean, we won the game, but realistically, we don't want our new signing. Loan offer for Ampadu. I'm going to completely block all deals for Ampadu because he is staying at the club. Um, there's no chance I will um, be uh, offloading Ampadu anytime soon. I'll also go look through my players later and um, list a few players just to see if we get any decent offers. Uh, other than that, I won't sell anything unless you guys want me to in the comments. So you need to make sure you let me know down in the comment section. Um, this second game is not really going well in the first half. As soon as I say that, Narsing puts us 1-0 up uh, here away. Uh, Morrison getting another yellow card in two games. He's got two yellows. It's not great. They've equalised there. 1-1. One, one. Can we get a late goal? Okay, we're going in. Oh, no, it's a draw because it's a group game. Forgot about that. Anyway, so we haven't lost yet, so that's not... That's all right. Now, our last game is against um, Sporting, not the Portuguese one. And I'll, I'm obviously getting these scout reports back for these players, but I'll leave that for this episode, and I'll let you guys comment more transfer suggestions uh, down below. Uh, this one here, Origi, one minute in, has put us 1-0 uh, up here. Rao's getting a yellow card in the 10th minute. Arigi scored four goals in preseason already. Narsing gets the second of preseason, puts us two 0 up. Ampadu gets the yellow card. Arigi gets another goal. He's on fire this preseason. He's proper making a statement for me not to sell him. Uh, Demore there coming off the bench and scoring. Ramsey missed a second pen in preseason. Rouse gets one five nil. Oh my days! We've absolutely dominated this team. Well, I mean, I'm not complaining. Five nil. Now who are we playing? Our oh, foreignent foreignent. Is that Foranence? Foranence Zone. Oh, I don't even know how you pronounce that. Don't care because we're going to beat them. Can we win? Starting off. 0-0. Can we get the first goal? They've got a yellow card in the 16th minute. Can... Oh, boom. Origi again. 28th minute. Origi bangs one. And we're 1-0 up. Origi, oh my god. Again. Something's wrong with Origi. Why doesn't he perform like this when I actually played the game? 2-0 <laughs> up. They've equalised. Or oh, Hoyler seals the game. 3-1. And then boom. So are we getting two more goals this um, in this preseason? Can you actually see the top scorers in this preseason tournament? Origi's got seven goals. Uh, we're against Ka Cagliari in the final. Transfer offer for Jarowski. That's going to get completely blocked and not going to sell him. Uh, all of this I don't need to look at. Oh, I didn't mean to press that. Um, yeah, most of this can just go. Yeah. Oh, we got an additional 1 million, I think that was. Hopefully we can win this here. 
uh, and then actually get some more money. I think it's like four million maybe um, for winning this tournament, I do believe. So hopefully we can do that here in this game. Come on. Origi, you've been doing... Oh, Clavan's just got injured. Joao Pedro just scored for uh, Cagliari. We're 1-0 down. Origi, like I was going to say, he's been performing... Oh, I love this cheek. The man of the hour just before half-time gets the goal to draw. Oh, it level us up. Still 1-1 here. Can we find a late goal? Hopefully we can. It's still... Nothing's happening. We won 4-3 on pens. Let's go. So we won the European International Cup. I think that's a good like 4 million plus onto our budget. 2.2 million, okay, it's not that bad, but I mean, it's money at the end of the day um, for winning that tournament. So let me just check how much we're on. T oh, back up to 28 million now, uh, so not too bad. Um, so I'm pretty buzzing about that, very uh, happy of that. So if I go into the squad, actually, do I want to look at the squad right now? Um, I'll go look at the transfers quickly. Uh, I'm not going to make any signings now, but I'm just going to quickly. Look at some of the ratings which um, from the suggestions you've given me. So, Ben Chilwell was from last season, but he's actually moved on. So, I don't think I'll be able to get him now. Uh, so, I'm going to remove him. Uh, in Kuku, he looks all right. He can play centre mid, left wing and right wing. 21 years of age. How much does he worth? This player has just recently joined. Oh, wow. That's annoying. Um, okay. So, most of those players aren't ready to come on yet. So, anyway... This is going to be the end of the episode. If you did enjoy, please leave a like. Comment your transfer suggestions because I do need transfer suggestions for the um, season uh, up ahead. We've got a big season ahead. I want to get top four this season. I know it's pretty um, pretty of a, like a big ask, but I'm going to try and get top four this season. Second season, you know, we want to be pushing on or even a Europa League spot. Anyway, subscribe if you are new around here. I will see you guys in the next video. We're approaching 500 subscribers. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.